Hi, I'm J.D. Hoovener, and welcome to The Bold Today Show, where you, the entrepreneur, business owner, or inventor, get your daily inspiration on how to make the world a better place. All right, we're going to be doing a three-part session and a three-part challenge for you. In the next three days, we're going to go over business planning. This first step is pretty straightforward, but listen up. If you already have a business plan, you need to think about where you're going to be in the next five years. And if you don't have a business plan yet, you need to get one together. And if you're in a J-O-B, you're in a job, you need to put a plan together to first see what it takes, what it's going to take to get you out the door. This first step of the, of the process and your first challenge is to do a simple thing. Describe clearly what it is you're going to sell and who is going to buy it. Report back tomorrow for more. All right. And taking that first bold step, right, and putting a business plan together does take a lot. It's probably more psychological than it is physical, right? What does it take? Picking up a pen, writing down on, you know, what your product is, what you're going to sell, what your service is, and who's going to buy it, right? Making that move and that decision to put a plan in place and get the wheels in motion is a big deal. It reminds me of the first step in the patent process. And I want to make sure that everyone here and all you listeners understand that we're in the U.S. filing system, and we just had a big change after the American Invents Act that we're now in a first-to-file system as opposed to first-to-invent. I'm going to give you a brief breakdown of what that means. Before 2013, what it meant to get to have first in line, to have priority preference, is if you could prove that you truly invented the product or system first, you could get the patent. And after 2013, it actually doesn't matter who invented it first. It's actually the first person to get in line and file their patent with the patents, the USPTO. So today, make it, a, make it a real effort to think about people that you might know. Are you gonna be venturing in this business all on your own? Likely not. You know, you think about all those big companies that have made it big, they didn't do it by themselves. And so if you've got a potential business partner, I want you to give them a call or send this podcast to them. Make sure they understand how serious you are about making that first bold step in writing your plan. If it's Maybe if you don't have someone else you're gonna to talk to yet, how about a mentor or someone who's written a plan before? Ask them what they put down and see how they describe their product and services and who they're gonna be serving. So again, thanks for listening and being a part of the Bold Today Show. I'm your host, J.D. Hoovener. Be bold today. Go bold at boldip.com.